What's up guys, welcome to Apex. Thanks for tuning in. Samsung has started rolling out a brand new update for Samsung Notes application, which adds a new widget with a list of notes. As you can see, the version number is 4.4.08.55. And in the change log, it says, addition of widget with a list of notes and fixed bugs. Now in this video, we are going to take a look at this brand new widget. But before we go ahead, if you are noticing this particular area on this phone screen and wondering what has happened, the screen got actually damaged. A heavy water bottle kept on the table just fell on the screen and looks like these pixels are broken from inside. I don't think I will get it rectified because I will have to change the whole screen on the S23 Ultra, which is going to cost me a lot of money. So I might use the phone as it is and you might have to bear with me for a few more months with this screen. I'll try to use the S22 Ultra as much as possible, but some of the new updates may arrive only on the S23 Ultra. So this phone I will have to use and I don't have a second S23 Ultra with me. This is the only unit which I've got. So please bear with me. Now uh, going ahead, let me show you the widgets which were available for Samsung Notes app. As you can see this, we had three different widgets associated with Samsung Notes application. We had one by one note shortcut, uh, tapping on which we can directly access a note. And then we got this five by one note creator widget. And then we had five by two single note by tapping on which we could access one single note on the widget panel. Now let's go ahead and look at the brand new widget that has been added. Let me press and hold on the home screen. I will tap on widgets. Let's find Samsung notes here. As you can see, instead of three, it is showing us four widgets. I'll tap on this. Here it is. We've got five by two note list. I will just press and hold on this and add it to the home screen. The moment you drop it on the home screen, it will open up the notes app. You will be able to select the notes which you want on the widget. Now let me select a few of the notes here. I will tap on done. As you can see, we have got all these individual notes which we have just selected and we can directly access each note by tapping on it right from here. That is just amazing. Now you can also scroll through these notes if you have multiple notes uh, here on the note list. And if your widget is small, you can scroll through these widgets to access them. Now to add a new note, you just have to press and hold on the widget, tap on settings. As you can see, we have got note list here, which you've already added. You can just tap on plus button to add the new notes to the list. And we also have option to move these lists up and down. As you can see, we have got these arrow marks. Just press and hold on this and move these notes up or down depending on your requirement. Apart from that, you can also customize uh, the widget. We got this toggle match with dark mode. If you disable this, you can either set white or black background for the widget. And you can also adjust the transparency here as usual. This was already there for all the other widgets. You can do the same for the note list widget as well. A completely transparent widget also looks pretty cool. But if you're someone who would like to have the background, you can set either white or black and adjust the transparency here. This is a pretty cool addition, I would say, because now we can access individual notes right from the home screen using this particular widget. If you want some additional notes and if you don't want to fit into the same widget, you can also create stacked widgets. Just press and hold on the widget and tap on create stack. And again, go to the Samsung Notes application here and tap on the list widget or if you want any other widget of Samsung Notes, you can select it and create a stack so that you can access multiple Samsung Notes widgets right on the home screen. Let me know what do you think. This is a cool addition, I would say. What's your opinion? Drop a comment. And while you do that, be sure to subscribe to the channel and give this video a like if you find it useful. Thanks for watching. My name is Salian signing off. Cheers. Bye-bye.